This is my law firm accounting tech stack. Warning though, it is not complicated. Another warning, I am a big fan of using specific platforms for specific purposes, not trying to find some all-in-one solution that does everything just okay. So here's what I do. First and foremost, for my payment processing, I use Stripe. Okay, my law firm is a flat fee, earned upon receipt firm. We don't bill by the hour, so we don't need to run anything through our trust account. So we don't use law pay or anything like that. It's just straight up Stripe. Stripe runs the payment. Payment gets put into the bank account. Bada bing, bada boom, done. Number two, I use PandaDoc as my sort of document fee agreement service provider. I use them for one main reason. And I don't know if you can do this with other platforms now, but back in the day, it was the only platform that allowed you to do fee agreements and receive payments like in the same sequence. So with PandaDoc, when somebody signs a fee agreement, a payment button immediately pops up for them to complete the process. That's the way I wanted to do my business. And so that's what we use. And it works really, really, really good. Three, for my bookkeeping needs, I use, as you might expect, QuickBooks. Okay, I have used Zero in the past. I've used Wave in the past. The main reason I use QuickBooks is through Big Bird Accounting, I get a accounting account. So I can run my books through there. That's, that's the reason why I do it. I think all those platforms are great. But again, I don't use QuickBooks for invoicing. I don't use QuickBooks for payroll, which we'll get to in a minute. I use QuickBooks for accounting, which is what it's built for. That's what I use it for. I use Gusto for my payroll needs. Gusto is super good. All they do is payroll. It's pretty cheap to use and it gets done every time on time correctly. And you just have to push a couple buttons. So do that. Their support is also good. I used them a couple times and they were really responsive and, and really helped me out. On the last thing I use for my accounting, this is less accounting, more sort of just a business metrics is a spreadsheet. So believe it or not, we use a spreadsheet for our sales tracking. It's just the simplest way to do it. I have a bunch of columns put up there. They outline the different metrics that I'm looking for, both to see if I, as a business owner, am doing a good job and to see if my attorneys are doing a good job with the potential client meetings that they're taking. I've been using it for years and it works perfectly and it could scale up and I'll probably keep using it until I find something better. But that is my accounting tech stack. Again, I lean more towards trying to find platforms that do a very, very specific thing very, very, very well. Often they talk to each other. Gusto and QuickBooks can talk to each other. Um, Stripe and PandaDoc obviously can talk to each other. Stripe talks to QuickBooks through my bank feed and the sales spreadsheet. It's just kind of on its own. So that's my accounting tech stack. Hope this helps. If you are not utilizing these services, if you are not getting organized in your financial sort of approach to your law firm, you're just missing out on a significant opportunity to do so. So get started. See ya.